Hello, what's up archers? This is Nasri from RC4 Archery. Today we have a requested battle against Russia against Russia. So, you, so the, basically the two nation names are pretty <laughs> almost the same. Russia and Russia. You just add a P at the beginning. So yeah, so the map I'm gonna choose today, like like usual, I'm gonna use the grassy flatlands for balanced tournament play. So I'm gonna set the mediums to small and the AI strength at an aspirin. So yeah, I'm gonna be using the Prussian against the Russia. Ah yes. So the Russian have general staff, six Eberhaus artillery, the Cossack cavalry, and two Russian Jaegers, two musketeers, and Opelschnir. I really don't know how to pronounce their name, but well, whatever. So. Uh, so I will, I will be commanding the Prussian army. So I have general staff, six Eberhaus artillery, hussars, musketeers, and three units of Landwehr. And I have a Silesian Schwitzen. This is a very elite rifle. So let's begin the battle. So okay. So Stella Joe, brother Stella Joe, thank you for requesting this battle. So I hope it's gonna be a short battle. So yeah, so we're gonna begin soon. Musketeers here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But yes, I'm gonna use the landwehr as a flanking unit. But would it be a good idea? Yes, sir. Yeah, I think so because I'm gonna yes, I'm gonna also use the Silicon Trees yes, to engage the enemy. So my left flank are secure with the Hussars and the General Stars should be here too because yeah, I, I would need to outflank the enemy really good so my ambush artillery should be moving now so let's move forward come on guys, I'm gonna run right now so uh, my artillery should be in this position so yeah, come on guys, these horse artillery are very fast unit because if you uh, limber the artillery, you you can get a uh, pretty much speed to deploy anywhere you want. So yeah, so my artillery is in the position, we're gonna limber now. So my army has stopped marching, I need to move them as quickly as possible. So they are marching towards the enemy. The enemy has stretched out their lines, but that's really concerns me because their left flank uh, actually have a lot of cavalry unit. So I'm gonna start firing at them at a point blank range and hoping that I hit somewhere. And yeah, the enemy has responded. I'm gonna pause for a while and forget where my army was. I think my the enemy are targeting my my unit so I'm gonna I'm gonna form up here come on guys come on come on come on this run where this militia unit are actually not quite good as you think but they can they can be a very effective unit to pull off against the line so yeah I need to be careful because the enemy have two units of Russian Jaeger so they are firing at my musketeers and the Cossack Cavalry are charging in. I need to worry about that. The Cossack Cavalry. Come on, come on, come on, guys. Fire, 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 fire. Come on, come on. Oh, here goes my artillery. Oh, yeah. But luckily, the enemy. But they didn't wait at all. So, do I have enough unit? Uh, no. Come on, guys. Yes, sir. Use the artillery. Yes, sir. I want you to target the uh, ah, the general staff. So I need to from here to the front. Yes, sir. Come on, guys. So, so the Russian gates. Yes, sir. I need to engage the Russian gates right now. I'm more worried about the cavalry unit in this game, but I'm more worried about these Russian Jaegers because they can do a serious damage to me. So my citizens should be firing. 
Wait, 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 wait. No. Sorry. Sir, our general is under attack. So, yeah. I'm hitting the Russian Jäger so hard right now. I hope yes. the Russian Jägers break. So, they are almost break. So, now we need to move quickly. So, the generals are actually yes, coming yes, in from support. So, nice yes, I know. Why did I always lose my general in this battle? I need to get them uh, out of the win as quickly as possible right now. So, the Russian Jaegers don't have that many men right now. So, yeah. My Slytherin trees are now taking a heavy damage. Uh, what happened over here? The Russian Jaegers. Our oh, men are running! Oh, uh, no. I didn't realize that. Oh, it's gonna be a great, terrible loss for me. So, you know. Let's go to the students here. Let's let them just keep firing. So, I take out the ad. I need to take out the artillery because this is what concerns me the most. So, yeah, back to my army. So. I mean, I'm still holding line, but uh, the musketeers are breaking right now. Our men are running, sir. And two of my musketeers are running. It's gonna be bad for me because the enemy is very clever. Very clever at this time. And the musketeers are firing. Um, my militia uh, should not be handling well. But I still have my cavalry unit, so I can do a hammer and anvil tactics. And this opportunity. Uh, I think we need to destroy this general staff. Come on, guys, come on, come on. Oh, what just happened? Our men are running, sir. Yes. Our men are basically running away from the battle. This is not good for me. They are waving. General, die, 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 please die! Yes, sir! Oh, come on, please die, please die. Oh, it's very tough. Yes, sir! It's really tough. Come on, guys, come on, yes, come on, sir. come on. Kill the general. We have killed their general, Yes! Sir. Now they must break! So I'm gonna target this. Okay. Yes, My army are uh, not wilding anymore, so this uh, musketeers are stopped wilding. So, what happened over here is, oh yeah, my skirmishers do uh, stop running, so I can use them at good effect. So, remember, in this battle, I, uh, the light infantry plays the most important roles in battle, but for me, the light infantry is just uh, pretty good, but they are not really good. They are not really good against many units. So, that's right, I need, I need them to engage. So uh, the militia unit is a target. So you're gonna yes, target. Sir. Fire and fire and advance. So my skirmishers are firing at the Russian Jaegers. Come on, take that, guys. Take that. Ah, I'm gonna have my revenge on you. Really? Since, since I still have my cavalry, they can be a great threat to the enemy. So this musketeers, you can see this the Russian musketeers are actually running away from from me. So I need to stop right now. So yeah, the Russian Jaegers are charging in. So I need to have some generous general support. Oh, come on, I need them to run away from the battle. Oh come on! Uh, I hope the I hope the cavalry unit can can give support and soon as possible. Are they running? Oh, are they walking? So, yeah. Stop over here and start firing. Come on, come on, guys, come on. Pick up the cavalry. So, these musketeers are here, are sitting down, so I need to engage them. So, he sees my, uh, the enemy sees my cavalry unit, so I'm gonna engage them right now. So, we have retain range, so they can, are they gonna form up squares? No. Oh, 
so they got they got my best so this is not good guys this is not good and this still have this unit so my solution written up um running from the battle again this is not good. i need to protect the russian niggas. all hope is lost sir this oh, yeah. battle is almost done yes sir what's up my army is basically just get wrecked and destroyed. <laughs> and yes, I did lose this battle, but it was a fun battle. I enjoyed this match because yeah, we are much better in this expert mode. Mm, but yeah, so that's <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. So yeah, so I'm gonna see you next time. This is Nasuki from Ice for actually thank you for tuning in, in Napoleon Total War Battle. So I hope you guys enjoy my video and subscribe to me. I, I will do more videos about archery and non-related archery. So I see you guys next time. Bye.